For 40 years, he was the voice that narrated the epic moments of Carolina basketball across North Carolina and around the world. Kupchak will make the long front court pass. Gets it to Walter Davis. Two, one, Walter takes the shot. Across the timeline with 10, knocked away, Dudley Bradley. Dudley Bradley for the stop. 70 to 68, 3, 2, 1. Matthews off balance, off the glass. Dudley Bradley's defense did it. For it, loose ball, recovered Marvin, he scores. 17 seconds left. Woody Durham graduated from Carolina in 1963. His career as the voice of the Tar Heels started in 1971, and over the course of the next four decades, he provided the call for 1,342 Carolina men's basketball games from around the country and around the world. Tar Heel fans turned down the sound of their televisions to hear Woody describe the action of 26 different Tar Heels whose jerseys hang in the rafters, including eight National Players of the Year. He was behind the mic for 20 Tar Heel ACC regular season championships, 12 tournament titles, 13 Final Fours, and of course, four Carolina Basketball National Championships. Goes back to Michael Jordan, jumper from out on the left, good! 13, 12, 11, Georgetown with one timeout. Fred Brown looking, oh, wait a worthy, worthy five! The Tar Heels are going to win the National Championship! Now that the belt is over, Carolina, the Tar Heels have won the national championship. Long outside shot, short rebounded. May, it's over. Carolina has won the national championship. 89-72, and how about them Tar Heels? They are the national champion. In September of 2015, the Naismith Memorial Basketball Hall of Fame honored Woody Durham with the Gowdy Award, which celebrates members of the media who have made a significant contribution to the game of basketball. Tonight, we'd like to honor Woody for his significant contribution to Carolina basketball, for reminding us when it's time to go where we go and do what we do, and for bringing Carolina basketball into our homes, our cars, and our lives for 40 years. Ladies and gentlemen, please help me welcome to the Smith Center floor, accompanied by his former broadcast port partner and former All-America, Eric Montross, and his wife, Jean, the 40-year voice of the Tar Heels, Woody Durham. As you heard in that video piece a few months ago, thanks to the initial encouragement of Jack Hilliard, the Naismith Basketball Hall of Fame named Woody the recipient of the Kurt Gowdy Award for his significant contributions to the game of basketball. Past winners of that award include Dick Inberg, Bob Costas, Jim Nance. Next year's winner, in fact, is here tonight from ESPN, Jay Billis. So, Woody receiving this award, I know he's a Dukey, but that's okay, we like Jay. Woody receiving this award simply means that people on the national level know what we Tar Heels have known for a really long time. Woody Durham is one of the absolute best in the business. I am confident that every Tar Heel here tonight has a favorite moment or moments that are significant to you. And I'm also confident that the voice that's playing in your head right now 
whether that's Worthy steal, Stackhouse's dunk, Weber's timeout, Marvin's putback, whatever that play is, the voice you hear right now is the voice of this man, Woody Durham. So let me take this opportunity to speak for the dozens of former analysts, commentators, producers, and engineers who worked with Woody, the thousands of people who were directly influenced by him, and the millions of Tar Heel fans for whom he was the soundtrack of their Tar Heel experience. Woody, congratulations on your well-deserved award, and thank you. Thank you, Woody, for your work ethic. Thank you, Woody, for your passion. And thank you, Woody, for your voice. Ladies and gentlemen, the voice of the Tar Heels, Woody Durham.